so I had to steal Sonic's camera. He had to go do some stuff. He'll be back probably shortly. But the guys just changed uh, the oil on Rob from V-Race Works Coupe, and we're gonna go ahead and strap it on the dyno right now. Jamie's gonna go ahead and load it up, so I'll get you guys back in when it's loaded up. Let me guess, you didn't bleed the coolant. No. Jarek, let me guess, you didn't clean the injectors. No. How come every car that hits a dyno, Jordan forgets to do something? You always look, look at it. Always under the hood. I, I ain't gonna hold you. I don't think I don't think this one was J-Rock. No, I don't think this is no. J-Rock. This might have been Jamie. Me? I'm just a tuner, bro. Blame the tuner. That, that's it. Dino with Rob V Raceworks car. 
this is the car that actually introduced me to Rob. I started following him because of this car. Um, I didn't know a bunch of stuff about the car. Like, I didn't know he bought the car new. I didn't know this car was in Honda tuning. I, I wasn't like big on that. Double issue. Yeah, J Rock told me that the car was in Honda tuning. Yeah. Uh, what year was that? It was a double issue. Uh, it was um, December 2011 to January 2012. Okay. We actually had eight. We had eight pages on in the magazine Damn. to me and my brother. Uh, so you bought this car new in 99 or 2000? 2000. 2000. 2000. 2000 EM1. I bought it new, zero miles. Um, it's been th it's been with me everywhere. I've driven this car to Florida, fucking Texas. It's been through everything with me. Can you tell them what you told me about how your business, you own uh, V Race Switch? Switch, yeah. How did you tell me that this car basically, you know, like started? Changed my life. Yeah. So I come from a corporate job. Okay. So I had a good job, benefits, everything. It was um, the thing that used to come in was a schedule. Mm -hmm. So when I bought this car and I started, I was in um, Honda Tech, all the forums back in the days, B20 V Tech. I realized that I can make a living from selling parts. Okay. So I started kind of transitioning from my corporate job to being in business for myself. And in 2007, I opened up V Raceworks. When, I want to ask you this, I'm pretty sure everybody wants to know this too. When did this car take a turn? It obviously didn't come terrible factory. When did it, when did you turn that, yeah, take 2006. that? 2006. 2006, so what made you change? I just needed more power. Okay. The B16 was just, just not the motor for me. Okay. Um, at, at that time, I took the B16 out, kept the B16, I put a, a B20 VTEC uh -huh. on 10 pounds. The car made like 304. And in hey. 2006, that was a lot of power. You had probably like, oh, what are those uh, uh, FMUs, the fucking yeah, uh, VTEC the, controller? No, the Apex, <laughs> the Apex <laughs> VTEC controller. You know how I know this car is old school, right? Uh, the blow out valve, that's one thing, yeah, like, yeah. it's HKS, older, like, blow out valve, but a lot of the parts on here are yeah. new. I mean, uh, the blow out valve is new, but it's old style. It's old style, yeah. yeah. And I'm, a, I, you know, I'm an OG. I don't want to say my age, but, you know. <laughs> you look younger than me. <laughs> I, you know, I appreciate this stuff, and, and, you know, as you guys know now, the older Hondas are, are like, the thing now. Yeah. You know, they're so, you know, they, they retain their value and exceed their value. Can you give us a quick rundown on the setup? So... It's um, 82 millimeter. That's a it's a Type R block. Okay. Dart and sleeves. Um, it's running a set of um, VTEC crack so hard. It's running a set of 2008 Skunk Two Tuner Ones. Oh wow! You know those, those are the the cams to get. So on idle, the car idles great. But when it when VTEC kits, you feel it. You know. So what size turbos on here? It's a GT. It's a GT 40R with a 98 back housing. Okay. So it's kind of big for what it is, but aesthetically, I needed to have something that looked good, you know. What's on this car that's discontinued, rare, like? Because you we you can said start, we can start with the uh, hood dampeners. Teen. These these teen hood dampeners. I bought these in 2013. Spoon mirrors discontinued in 2022. Okay. They're no longer on the catalog. They don't exist. <laughs> That Mugen Hub, I don't even know the price of that. That is, I bought that, I want to say 2011. This car got a lot of nice parts. That's a second gen spoon, second gen spoon shift knob. Um, I know the wing, the wing's a, gotta be discontinued. That's an EK4 wing, which is an EK4 for a 98 four door. And I got it to fit as, as good as possible. The way you know it's original is when you see the L, you see the R and the L. Oh, I see the R under there. And the L. Alright. That's how you know it's original. This car looks great. Thank you, man. Yeah. And honestly, the car always looked great, but now it's running. You know? I've uh, followed Sonic for, for a long time now. Respect what he's done at the track. Um, Jamie, hands down, one of the best tuners in the country maybe even the Nate you know the fucking world I, I need Excuse to I, I need to say something so yesterday I called Rob I said yo Rob I can't figure the car out I was like yo the I can't had a gremlin, man. yeah it had a gremlin we couldn't figure it out so he was like you know what it's okay we're gonna figure it out and uh, Rob's so positive on the phone I'm just like yo Rob I can't figure it out he was like you know what when Jamie gets there I know you guys are gonna figure it out 
Uh, Jamie got here, I think, the first day. We didn't figure it out. So he had more time the second day. He came here last night. I got the car running, and he was so happy that we got the car running. To be honest with you guys, if you guys know me, I'm always, like, on, you know, on top of business. I'm one of those guys that I return every missed call. I return every DM, every email. But I, I kind of put myself, you know, second, always. Explains Today, why your car was sitting for a year. Sitting for a year, and not only that, it, it hasn't been on Broadway. It hasn't been in the city in Manhattan since 2016. So wow. it's been here in Connecticut. So for me today, it's like, for a lot of you guys, it's a regular Friday, but for me, it's not a regular Friday. Today's your Dude, birthday, bro. Today's my birthday, <laughs> yeah. man, seriously. Like, I'm, Overall, how's your experience here today? 100%, man. I'll be honest with you guys, this is like the, this is the cleanest, most organized, grease-free shop I've ever been to. <laughs> and I'm big on bathrooms. The bathroom here, <laughs> you, you, you don't have to wipe the toilet seat. <laughs> no. That's all I gotta say. <laughs> well, I appreciate that, bro. Thank course, you. Uh, I'll drop your tag. Uh, yep. I'll drop your tag in the video. Let them know where to find you. Yeah, yeah. If you guys need any parts, hit them up. Abby Raceworks. Uh, I'll drop his Instagram tag in the video. And uh, we'll see you guys next time.